Hello everyone. Today I will show you how to to read a BMW EVS 3. Normally this this type of EVS or this connector can be easy read with uh, Xprog. It have a nice adapter for the plug and you will need only to solder a wire. But I will not read with uh, Xprog. I will uh, I will do the reading with the uh, CG Pro programmer because also this EVS3 have the same model of chip but the connector is different. So if you have this type of EVS, you will not able to read with Xprog. Why I will show you on this? Because this was untouched, not, not programmed, not even by the boot pin, so it's here, or the memory was not touched. On this, I work in the past, so the coating was removed. And I wanted to make a video to show how you can read and program it. But the, the masks are the same. Normally it's a 0, 4, it's a 0, D, 4, 6, G. As you can see both are having the same chip. So let's begin by First, removing the the mask. I will show you my my way how I remove the mask. I have this. It's Nitro Morse all purpose uh, paint and vanish remover. I use a lot when I have uh, boards with coating. So what I will do? I will apply on the chip on all the sides I hope it's it's enough. I have a workplace area. Okay, this has been put. I will leave like this uh, the next 10 minutes. The video will be on the fast forward until it's ready to clean. Okay, about 10 minutes pass, let's uh, see the result, I lost something, I found it, 
let's clean and see how how we can proceed reading it as you can see it's peeling off in big chunks also from the chip just scraping the green stuff it's removing the the orange coating what i will do more easy i will put alcohol and with the brush i will clean maybe from the first try not all areas will be clean but in this case i think most of required area for us it will be very clean I think it's nicely clean and let's uh, proceed with the reading also you can read in this way with AK90 if you have or other in circuit programs I will power up my power supply connect the programmer we will need also the computer here the USB Let's find the marking. Here is the corner. I will put like this. Maybe I will need to keep to keep it pressed. it's working so I will keep like this and uh, let's go to the computer I have bands I will try to to read without pressing it Okay, operation failed. If I press it, okay, and we have uh, data. Let's save it on the desktop. File saved successfully as a short test. I will uh, open EFI software and see if the file is loaded correctly. I will open this one and automatically have been identified as EBS. And 
Bitte. That's it. Of course, this can be easy read with Xprog, but this one it will not be read easy. Let's try to read also this one. Pressing. Let's see the data is changing. Okay, as you can see, another data. Second file. Two minutes later, also identified correctly. Okay, easy job, hope it helps, see you next time, bye bye.